Max Verstappen crashes when leading first race since Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. Max Verstappen's return to driving following the off-season began with a poor start at the weekend, as the Dutchman crashed his car into a wall in Saturday's virtual Le Mans 24-hour race. Verstappen, 24, won his first Formula One Drivers' Championship back in December with a thrilling final lap win over Lewis Hamilton in the United Arab Emirates. The pair became huge rivals last season, winning a combined 17 of the 21 races in the calendar. Preparations are set to begin ahead of the first race of the season in Bahrain, which takes place on March 20 after testing is finalized. And Verstappen will be aiming to win his second title after taking the accolade for the first time in his career in December. But he will need more practice if his recent driving skills are to be critiqued, after crashing his team Redline LMP2 into a tyre wall on Saturday's virtual version of the Le Mans 24-hour race according to Grand Prix 247. The Dutchman got behind the wheel in his house as he competed for the simulated version of the famous Le Mans 24 hours race. He started for Team Redline in a bid to win £100,000, with his teammates being Felix Rosenqvist, Atze Kirchhoff, and Max Beenecker. They began well, establishing a lead after seven hours of racing. However, going through the Ford chicane complex, Verstappen hit a curb venomously, slamming into a tire wall and destroying his vehicle. And he will be hoping that doesn't happen again in his first race of the season. Verstappen and Hamilton went neck and neck in their bid for the title last season, having entered the final day level on 369.5 points each. Despite leading by 10 seconds heading into the final five laps of the race, Hamilton was denied the chance to win after Nicholas Latifi's crash on lap 53 meant Fiat Chiefs issued a safety car. This allowed Verstappen to reduce his deficit behind Hamilton and also pit for new tyres, although it was expected that the Brit would be allowed to simply continue the race and saunter over the line for his eighth drivers' championship. Yet a controversial decision by F1 chief Michael Massey that allowed the five cars in between Verstappen and Hamilton to unlap themselves gave the Dutchman a clear shot at the title, overtaking Hamilton due to the new tyres he had fitted just four laps earlier. And Toto Wolff made his thoughts clear by claiming the incident will never be forgotten. That will never be forgotten. Because what happened to Lewis was just wrong, Wolff told Austrian newspaper Krona. He was unbeatable that day. Until the race management have blown the fuses and decided on three rule violations. It's just hard to understand.